Hi, I'm Lisa Soloway, and I am the co-coordinator of the Neighborhood Food Project through the Amherst Survival Center. I'm Jocelyn Potter, and I'm the co-coordinator of the Amherst Survival Center's Neighborhood Food Project. So the Neighborhood Food Project is a project to try to get more food into the survival, Amherst Survival Center so that, more, so that more food can go home with our participants. We're asking people to be neighborhood coordinators. And a neighborhood could be the neighborhood you live in, it could be your business, it could be your office, your book club, you know, just a group of people that you see regularly. So what we ask is that you maybe get five to ten people in your neighborhood, um, give them each a bag, and ask them each week as they go to the grocery store to put an extra can of beans or a box of pasta in this bag. And two months later, you go back and you pick up that bag the third Saturday of even months. And you replace it with an empty bag. And then you head on to over to the survival center where we have volunteers weighing, sorting, and stocking the shelves with food. Currently in the food pantry, we are able to um, send everybody who comes in um, with about home with about five days worth of food and our goal um, and through the neighborhood food project is to increase that amount to about seven days worth of food per person who walks through our doors. In the first year of the project um, I think we collected almost 6,700 pounds of food. Um, to date we're closer to 15,000. So through this project we've been able to increase the amount of food that's in the food pantry and distributed to participants. We have had some neighbors, some neighborhoods say to me that they really never knew their neighbors before they were involved in this project, that it's been a mechanism, a way for them to get to know their neighbors. We've had neighborhood coordinators who have had um, instead of doing a Saturday morning pickup like they would normally do, they will do a bonfire on Friday night and have the whole neighborhood come over and bring their um, bags. And so they're getting to know their neighbors a little bit more through this project. We're loving thy neighbor. We're helping those who are food insecure in our community, but we're also building that community in our own neighborhoods. Um, I know that this has strengthened the relationship I've had with my neighbors. Thank you to the Amherst Area Chamber of Commerce for this award. Um, it's, we're hoping that it will bring attention to the Neighborhood Food Project and help us expand it even further. So I'd like to thank the um, Amherst Chamber as well as the community for nominating Lisa and I for this award. But I'd especially like to thank Mindy Dome for helping us get this project off the ground and to Lev Ben Ezra for supporting us and helping us to make this a sustainable project for the future.